Hello everybody, uh, back with Rivet Training and we're going to look at uh, creating stairs by component in this video. Uh, be short and sweet. Uh, again, I have this plan view from uh, a workbook that I have. If you need it, I can turn it to you or you can use your own. Pretty simple. Okay, now basically uh, there will be 8 horizontal riders and 11 vertical riders. And we use the reference planes provided as guides. So use the cast in place monolith to stair. So we'll go to our stair. And we have our cast in place monolithic stair. And we have several types of stairs there. Okay. Uh, and then we'll set our base level to level one. Our top level will be level two. And um, our thread, our thread depth will be, let's see, uh, we'll set our thread depth to one foot, okay, uh, da, 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 thread, okay, this, this will make this a straight one, that's not bad to have it that size, but because you want to make it easy for people to go up and down these stairs. So anyway, uh, and then we want the desired number of risers here. We want to make this uh, 19. So we have that done. Okay, now you need to determine the distance from the top riser to 19 riser. All right. So uh, we'll select under the architecture tab. We'll select our stair. Uh oh. So we're already in there. So we got the place. That, yep, that's the stair we want. Our base level is one. Our base offset is zero zero. We're at level two and okay. So all of our settings are set. So now we want to go into our dimensions. And all these are okay. So then we want to go, um, just, we should be in our stair. Let me see if I can go back here for you guys. Okay. Now everyone will be there. So we want to select our run and then we'll select our straight. Okay. So we have run and straight already enabled as we can see. And it's just simply from this point here, we want to select the point from there to here. Uh oh, nope, nope, sorry, I want to undo that. I want to start this at grid six, so I want to start this here to this point. And then I want to select another point from this location. Nope, not this one. Sorry, I'm having a bad day today. From this point right here and up. Let's just tick it there. So there we have our stair. And let's hit the green tick mark. And there is our stair. So basically the most important thing is to get the settings right now. Let's go and verify the dimensions. Let's see. Go ahead and annotate. Dimension. This dimension should be 4 foot 5. Yep. And this one should be 4 foot 4 from here. And this reference point to this one. Okay. So that's it. That's how you do very simple. That's how you do uh, a stair by component. And I want to show you something here. Uh, we can select these stairs as we did before. And you got all these different types of stairs. You got the precast, cast in place, and assembled stair. So again, we've just covered uh, very simple. Stairs are very simple. They're, they're really smart and they really, 
it's not a lot of work you're doing. You just set the settings and, and away you go. So uh, thank you for watching this video. And if you like it, like it. Or if you have any questions regarding the video, please put it in the question section. And I'll be happy to answer. So again, thanks again for watching. And good night.